Hey everyone, and now we are going to overclock this uh, X3430 and uh, I'm really excited to do that actually that will boost up the performance and uh, you know, now we are ready to do that it is DT55TC and uh, this processor has the option to overclock which is <laughs> insane because it's just a base motherboard and it is an Intel original so that is really impressive for this one so what we are going to do is to we must have to put that on a manual we did that it is on a 133 because clock speed for now and we are going to increase it like like that okay yes uh, more just change it to like 3.5 oh that will be too much I guess <laughs> I don't know if my okay 3.2 3.2 now 3.20 because I <laughs> don't want to do that because uh, my uh, old processor was the same clock speed was on the same clock speed oh that just really decrease okay there's that much and uh, aren't really if I do automatic that would be too much so I shouldn't do that what about 20 7 7 7 that doesn't really work Nine, 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 twenty-four. Memory voltage is just, yeah, less. Well, uh, I don't know if I'll be able to do that because the, I think I should just uh, decrease the speed. Maybe that way it will work. And so let's do it. Multiply to six, or maybe twelve. <laughs> oh, that will just destroy six. Okay, so it is now lower. But I believe that if you because uh, if I do eight, it will be more than that, and that just giving the problem. Uh, when I did this for first time, it was just giving me lots of problems. So I don't want to do that again. Let's do it on uh, multiplier 6. Let's do it again. Let's see what would happen. And uh, it's 3.20. And yeah, <laughs> we boot up. Nice. Cool. For now, that much I can hiccup. And because my computer can't handle <laughs> more clocks, more speeds, so I must have to settle on 3.0 which is still better than nothing actually and uh, okay so we got everything we need okay so let's boot up again and this time I hope it will run <laughs> it should be boot menu F10 come on come on come up come up okay WDC nice okay okay so now it is done I can say that I cannot go more than 3 gigahertz at least on a stock Intel fan which is still better than anything I ever did on this fan and it is handling very well and uh, I don't know if for some reason it is using a lot uh, anyway so yeah we can use this one and it's working great and at the end we can say that we can overclock on an Intel stock motherboard so yeah we can use it, it like that nice great <laughs>